All right, since the last time I did the video of my home theater system, you'll notice some of my components have changed. I uh, sold my 32-inch Insignia to a friend, and I bought a 42-inch Vizio. Um, I, was, uh, I wasn't really planning on doing it, but I had a buddy who needed a new TV, and uh, so I sold in mine, and the price was right on this. I bought it at Walmart. Um, I received a discount. Nothing was wrong with it. It's just that I was told that they had another size in stock, and they didn't, and they suggested that I go with the 42-inch. And so I asked for a discount, and the manager was nice enough to give me one. So I got a 10% discount. The price of the TV came to like $852, and uh, and I'm very impressed with it. It's just a 1080i or 720p 1080i TV, but it looks great. Um, one of the other things that I've added also was, is a uh, Toshiba uh, HD A3 HD DVD player. Um, I bought that at Sears uh, during Black Friday, $169, um, and uh, it's running through HDMI to the uh, Harman Kardon AVR247, and then HDMI on up to the 42-inch uh, Vizio. Um, some people say, well, 1080p is better. Yes, probably, and I know they have 1080p HD DVD players out there. But what is the point of buying that if you have a 1080 iTV? There is no point. So the player works very well for my setup. Um, of course, I still have the Bose Acoustimass 16 for the speaker system. Um, and so now I still, of course, have my Philips hard drive recorder or hard drive slash DVD recorder. Um, I still love my Philips. It works great for recording, and where I don't have a uh, a um, DVR from the cable company or anything like that, it works great for my use. Plus, I can transfer from the hard drive onto a DVD, take it with me if I want to watch it on my laptop or something like that. So it's really a handy, handy player. So I've added the Toshiba HD DVD player to the Philips. So it gives me a pretty good, pretty good setup. Anyhow, uh, I have a DVD, or I have an HD DVD in right now. It is the Born Identity. It's one of the ones that come free with the player. You also get 300 with it. I've already bought a few HD DVDs. And Netflix rents them as well. And I've changed my rental preference to HD DVD. So when it's available, they'll send me that. And... Uh, it doesn't cost anything more, so it's pretty much worth it. I have Born Identity in right now. I'm going to go ahead and hit play. And I know it's not going to look that great on this little camera, but it'll give you an idea of what it looks like when it starts. Okay, and then uh, we come up to the menu, and HD DVD has a really nice menu, at least uh, the Universal discs. I really like how Universal does it, but it gives you a lot of options. You go set up, it comes over here and you have all your different options. And this, this menu will come right up while you're playing in the movie, I'll show you here in a second. It'll allow you to access it, okay? The soundtrack on this is a Dolby Digital Plus, and it's running through HDMI. Actually, the Toshiba is dec decoding Dolby Digital Plus, and then it runs it through a multi-channel PCM 
to my receiver through the HDMI. So that's doing the decoding work. Because my receiver can't decode the uh, new technology formats yet, even though it is a new receiver. So we'll go ahead and we'll hit, uh, we'll go ahead and hit play. And we'll go ahead and we'll start. Maybe if I back up a little bit, maybe. Hopefully you can see it from there. Not sure what would happen if I turned out the light up above here. It's probably worth a shot anyway. There we go. Granted, you're dealing with the quality of my camera here, so I have a little RCA small wonder camera, so it's not going to really probably do a lot of justice to this. And they're kind of what my components look like in the dark. Of course, you can dim them down. There's enough lights on there to enough lights on there that might distract some people. But anyway, that is the uh, Toshiba HD A3 HD DVD player playing on a uh, Vizio 42 inch. LCD TV, Harman Kardon AD, AVR247 with the sound, and uh, playing through a Bose Acoustimass 16 for surround sound. Thank you for watching my video.